Hi, I'm Adriana Powell with the Toy Industry Association, and I'm here today to talk about toys and games that are terrific for summer travel. First off, really important to get kids excited about the journey and not just the destination, whether you're getting on a plane, a train, or a quick staycation car trip to grandma or grandpa's house. So what we've done is we've taken these bins and we've actually personalized and decorated it. And you may have some of these things already around your house, some stickers you may want to put on. Um, this is mine and I'm ready to pack all of my toys and games in here. Um, don't need to buy everything. It could be things you have around the house, like some crayons and markers and just some creative storage. And that's great for kids who love arts and crafts. Um, we have some other arts and crafts projects like from Creativity for Kids. And this is the cool Metallics book. It comes with metallic colored pencils right here. They're attached to the book. And kids color. And actually, when you're done, there's little perforated edges. So when they finish, they can rip it off and you know, give to whoever is near their adventure. When you, when you get to grandma, you may want to give her a present that you made for her. And again, this packs very easily in this box or in a bag. From Crayola, we have this mess-free color wonder paper and magic metallic effects. So it's special paper, special markers that won't make a mess, but really cool metallic effects. Um, make a robot, a fish, butterfly, all things kids love to create. So that's for arts and crafts. And learning doesn't have to stop over the summer. There's so many fun learning toys. Starting off with the youngest kids. This is my first leap top and we can turn it on here and you'll see it speaks to the kids. It has an icon for their email. Um, a lot of things mom and dad are gonna have on their laptop. So when you're packing up your laptop bag, your youngster can take their first leap top with them. So we can put this in here. And then for older kids, we have from VTech MobiGo. And this is a handheld gaming system, teaches kids letters, numbers, um, learning games, and also has different cartridges. So for younger kids that may want to play with Elmo and Abby Kadabby, or older kids, there's a SpongeBob, and there's all different types of characters kids can take with them to learn. So let's pack these up and put these away and get ready to get started with more. Games are a perfect thing to pack for summer travel. Not only are many games small and compact, they're terrific to use when you're traveling and also when you arrive to play as a family. Starting off, we have this game called Who Would Win? And this is from Game Right, and it just asks really silly questions, like who would, eat a, who would win a hot dog eating contest, Donald Trump or Albert Einstein? And you and your family can debate, decide, you can vote, and it's just a lot of silly, kind of goofy fun. So I can pack this in here. And this is called Joe Name It. This is another game for older kids. Um, you have to name a movie with two sequels. How about a music group with three members? So just questions and asking you to name series. So you can kind of test everybody's trivia. Now card games. Some classic card games. We have Crazy Old Fish War card game. We have Uno. Uno is celebrating its 40th anniversary. This is very easy to pack on the go. And even a Yahtzee card game. And like I said before, this may be stuff you already have in your house. It's good to take with you on the go. Many of you may know the game Zingo. Well, this is the Zingo travel game. And what you do here is you shake up the car and you see two dice. So I have a dog and I have a bicycle. Each person in your family gets these little cards. It's kind of like bingo. So on this one, I have a bicycle and I will flip over the bicycle. The first person to get all three items on their card wins. And there's no mess, there's no loose pieces, and Zingo actually comes with its own little travel carrying case, so that makes it even easier to take with you. And you can pack this right in here too. Now, smaller version of classic play, this is Travel Battleship. So this takes the game, you probably already have at home too, and it's a smaller version. Um, the pieces do fit in and it's really easy to travel with. Now, also, for people who like mazes, this is called the Maze from Think Fun. And what you do is, they're all different mazes. There's about 16 and the you can go through and you follow your pen and See if you can get through the maze. 
fun part about it is once you solve the maze, you can just push it over with your pen and it creates a whole new challenge. So 16 in all, um, great for people who love mazes and brain teasers. And this one is from Melissa and Doug, and this is a take on Hangman. So you don't have all those pieces of paper littering your car. What you do is you spell out a word, somebody will guess the letter B. Oh, the letter B is not in my puzzle. So you'll flip over, and the object of the game is to solve the puzzle on the bottom before you make the entire Hangman. And this wipes off, and you can start all over again. So these are just some examples of great games to take with you on the go. I'm going to put these aside and I'm going to come back with some more toys to take on the go. This summer when you're packing up some toys and games, it's important to remember that most kids really want to bring a friend along with them. So action figures, collectibles, and play sets are a welcome addition to your suitcase. Starting off over here, I have a shoulder buddy, and these are brand new from the Bridge Direct, and I just love these because they come in all different colors. Um, Young girls are really going to gravitate towards them. You can match them with your outfits. You can trade with friends. And it's just this little disc that is magnetized, and the shoulder buddy will adhere to it. So you can put it on your shirt. You can put it on your backpack. Um, I'm sure kids will think of many creative ways to play with their shoulder buddies. And like I said, it's just very easy. I'm just going to slip mine off right now. Other things that little girls love to collect are animals, and these are terrific. They're from calico critters, from international playthings. So rabbits, bunnies, hamsters, and they all come with their own little piece of furniture and their own carrying case. So as you see, this takes up absolutely no space at all. And boys like to bring friends with them too or play their play sets. This is from Hot Wheels, and this folds out. They have a, you know, the plane comes off, it sticks down, it locks in. And the best part about this is that you can just flip up the handle and take it with you ready to go. And what little girl wouldn't want this stylish Barbie purse? But the fun part about it is it actually opens up to a play set. I have a Barbie in here that I packed. She does not come with the set. But girls can take their own Barbies and you can store the clothing, you can role play right in the back seat of the car. And the best part about it is when you fold it up, you have a very stylish purse, just like your mom or your older sister. And boys also like to take stuff with them on the go. Um, this Ninjago carrying case opens up. Not only can you store things in it, but it's actually a battle station. So I have my Lego Ninjago figures, but I also have some Ben 10 figures that I brought along with me. Um, boys love Ben 10. These action figures are small and they're great. You can even put them in the water, in the pool. and. I'm going to fold everything up in this carrying case. And for young kids who want to snuggle with a friend, or maybe some kids who are a little bit older but aren't used to sleeping in certain environments, these are great from Cloud B. And what they do is you turn them on, and this is a travel sleep sheep, and they make different noises. So you have a stream or rain. So they just soothe kids when they're in unfamiliar surroundings. And this can ad adhere to a crib or a stroller. And um, they come in all different characters. There's the sleep sheep, the dolphin, and the giraffe. So I am almost all packed up and ready to go. I'm excited to go on vacation. But I want you to remember that when you're packing to travel this summer, these are just some of the examples of all the terrific toys we have with, to take on the go. And please check back to toyinfo.org often for more trends and information.